Yo guys, really quick before the video starts, according to YouTube's analytics, 98% of you that watch my videos aren't subscribed, which is like, what are you doing, bro? Just hit the button. All right, guys, enjoy the video. Yo, what's going on, ladies and gents? My name is Arbuckle. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are once again back on Modern Warfare, and I wanted to share with you guys the best class setup for the FN SCAR 17. Uh, this is not for any specific blueprint. This is for the standard gun, uh, and it's actually a really, really good one. If you guys take a look at the stats uh, that we're going to get for the class setup, I'm going to share with you in this video. You'll see we boost almost everything. We get really nice accuracy and range, a nice little fire rate boost, uh, a really good mobility boost, as well as a control boost. The only thing uh, we are not gaining is damage, which is obviously not a big deal. Uh, this is a really, really good weapon for not only accuracy and range, being able to hit people from long distance, but it's a very mobile class as well with good aim down sight speed and sprint to fire speed. So if you guys take a look at the attachments, we're not going to be using a muzzle. The barrel that we're using is the Forge Tac 20 LB. This is what's going to give a significant boost to accuracy, range, and control. As you guys can see, we get massive boost here. We lose a ton of mobility, which obviously we'll make up for with some of the other attachments, but a really really good attachment to have when it comes to accuracy and range. We're not going to be using a laser and we're not going to be using an optic. I think the SCAR's iron sights are really good and we don't want to lose more aim down sight speed uh, by running an optic. So we're going to pass on that one. The stock that we're using is the FTAC collapsible stock. Uh, this is going to boost our aim down sight speed to make up for our last attachment and give us a massive boost of mobility to make up for our mobility drop uh, in the last attachment as well. We lose a tiny bit of control range and accuracy here, which isn't that big of a deal because we gain so much uh, with the last attachment. But the FTAC collapsible stock uh, is the stock we're going to be using. The underbarrel that we're using is the Commando Foregrip. So uh, we're getting massive boost to accuracy, range, and control once again here. We only lose a tiny bit of mobility. Uh, and the reason we're running the Commando instead of some of the other ones is we don't want to lose more aim down sight speed. And with the Commando, we're able to get that recoil stabilization and that aiming stability without sacrificing more aim down sight speed. So uh, a really good attachment for the SCAR. We're not running any extra ammunition. We don't really need any. Uh, the rear grip that we're using is stippled grip tape. This is really, really important. Uh, obviously, boosting our aim down sight speed and sprint to fire speed, giving us another nice mobility boost, uh, really putting us in the green for that. Uh, and last but not least, the perk that we're using is sleight of hand. So this is going to allow us to be fairly quick with this weapon. Uh, like I said at the beginning of the video, this weapon is very good for long distance, but is also very mobile. So you're going to have a lot of close quarters gunfight situations and be able to do really well with this setup. And having sleight of hand is going to allow you to reload and get back into those gunfights a little bit quicker. Uh, but I found this class up to be super good and, and really fun to use. I'll give you guys one last look at all the attachments and the stats that come with this class setup. Um, if you guys have any questions about about this specific class setup or anything else to add please make sure to leave them down in the comment section below uh, but i really hope you guys did enjoy this video please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and i'll see all you guys in the next yeah Can we be friends?